Okay, well here's the uh, DDS uh, VFO uh, using that uh, SI5351 board and um, boy I had trouble with the software. I, I, I don't, I haven't learned yet how to put in uh, the libraries and the files to program this thing. So Ron PA3FAT has been working on this and uh, he's got a BIX40 on order. And uh, this is what we're going to be using. And uh, he has taken code and modified it to put S meter and different things on here. So this is it. And look how great this little thing looks. Look at the readout. I'm going to turn the knob here. If I can hold it up, oh, if I can hold it and turn it at the same time. Let me see if I can. Well, here. okay. Not doing too good. There we go. It's on a 1KC, and if we press the button, you'll see it go to 10KC with the 10. Now we're tuning the 10KC. We're going to press it again. There's 100. We're going to tune 100. There's the 1000. So you can see we're tuning the 1000KC. There's 10,000. We can tune much faster. 100,000. Look at that. So, thanks to Ron, PA3FAT, and we're going to have him on the show uh, maybe in a few weeks, and we're going to talk about this, but there's the little uh, SA, uh, SI5351 board on top there. That is a very stable VFO. This thing will go... Uh, I, I from very low, um, down in the uh, low... Um, kilohertz to I think 160 megahertz